So today I'm gonna teach you a trick so that when you change your wheels your skate will feel like you've been skating them for a while. All you need for that is these and Hola YouTube, my name is Ricardo Lino and I'm a wheel addict. So you know when you've been skating your skates for quite a while and even if your wheels are old and you feel that they're rolling slower, you still feel that your skates are on point, like when they can turn better and especially if it's free skates or if it's like cruising skates, you feel that you're able to slide or to stop easier. And then when you change for new wheels, something like this, you feel that they don't turn. They don't feel like your skates. So today, I'm going to teach you a trick so that when you change your wheels, your skate will feel like you've been skating them for a while. But how, you fiend? Diabolically simple! Basically, you're going to break into the wheels a lot faster. All you need for that is this and a pair of skates. So basically, what I'm going to ask you to do is to take the middle wheel And now, you go out without the middle wheel, the middle wheel, just like all the other wheels, like the three wheels were new, just like these ones. And then you go out with two wheels and all I ask you to do is do a few power slides. You're gonna do a few power slides. Monday, hit the brake. Obviously when you do a power slide you're going to be using the inside edge of the skate which means that if this is the skate this is the inside edge so you're going to be sliding like this on these two wheels. There's other slides that you can do to use the other side but because the power slide is the easiest I'm going to tell you to do power slides. What you can do is you can change the wheels after just rotate the wheels take them out to rotate them like from here to here and then put them back on do a few power slides. Always on two wheels, you, you want to slide on the four wheels that you still have on the skate because you took the middle wheel from both skates. Then you put them back on, you put the, the middle wheel back on, and once you put the wheel back on, you're gonna feel that the skates will feel more like your older wheels used to feel. Obviously you can do this also with new skates when you want to break into the new skates. The goal here is to f basically go over that first layer that the wheels, that shiny new layer that the wheels have that make the wheels really really grippy. That's really good that the wheels are grippy but if you want to cruise around turn and that you're gonna end up feeling that sometimes that's a little bit restrictive. Obviously that depends on the type of skating that you want to do. When you do this slide without the middle wheel and you put the middle wheel back on, you ended up creating like a little rocker. Basically, this wheel will be a little bit lower than these two and this will make it easier for you to turn and also to slide. Obviously, this act that I just teach you can be done with three wheel skates, four wheel skates or even with five wheel skates. What you need to know is that the wheels that you want to be sticking out are the ones that you take out. So basically, if you'd be a four wheel skate, if I wanted the middle wheels to be the rocker, the, the lower wheels, I would take the middle two wheels, I would still do the power slide in the first and fourth wheel, and then stick the two wheels back again. Obviously, if I just want one wheel to stick out, I will not take two on a tri skate or three wheels on a four wheel skate and then <laughs> expect to do the slide on one wheel only. It's probably possible for guys like Pablo Soler that can do like toe slides and heel slides and all that, but I don't think that would be easy, so <laughs> that's it. So that was the trick, the little act that I had for you today. All you needed for that is these and a pair of skates. <laughs> Obviously, if your skates are old, I don't know, there might be X for that, but I didn't get there yet. 
maybe subscribe to the channel and I'll try to find an egg <laughs> for you to do to your skates to make them roll a little bit faster or a little bit better. Other than that, what can I tell you? Yeah, maybe don't forget to give me some thumbs up if you like this video. If you didn't like it, well, give me thumbs down, but please let me know what you didn't like about this video. And like I always say, please do not forget why we all started skating because it's fun. <laughs> Cheers, guys. See you soon.